Puma uh, is is voting in Texas, a foregone conclusion. I mean, it's a red state. So uh, are you expecting any surprises? And uh, what are the issues that people are voting for? Immigration, uh, you know, reproductive rights. Uh, what is it that uh, is on the top priority for the voters? But as you can see behind me, it hasn't dampened the spirits of the voters. The people are flocking in numbers. I'm right now uh, at the Babs Mandir, the, uh, which is the, the third consecutive year that this is a polling station for uh, the elections. And uh, Texas being the second largest immigrant state, um, I think a lot of people are definitely going to uh, look for better immigration policies. Now, a 50, uh, like a more than 15% of the population is it comprises of immigrants, mostly from, um, from Mexico, but the second largest uh, immigrant population is the Indians. So we're definitely looking for better immigration policies. And uh, like yesterday also, we spoke a, a lot about uh, reproductive rights. I think that is one thing a lot of uh, people, especially women, are looking to change because a lot of lives has been lost in the past due to these policies in place and people are looking forward for a change in these. And um, as we all uh, speak a lot about uh, reproductive rights and abortion laws, laws uh, a lot has been uh, not spoken about is the medical and the healthcare system, which is in place uh, over here. Basic, basic things like insulin, can, cannot be accessible to, um, to the patients, which is definitely something to worry about, something of concern. And uh, in the past, we've seen how people are sourcing things like insulin from, uh, in the, from, the black, uh, you know, from the black market or sourcing it out from the countries uh, that, are, um, you know, that they can get access to.